I always say, when I'm spending over fifteen dollars on a, a yeah. super buttercream, I need we to about see to tune into that. Let's say vibes. hydration. I need moisture. Let's say vibes, y'all. Vibes, y'all. She says love my good hair. Let's say vibes, y'all. Keeping it live, y'all. She says love my good hair. Sugar Lachey Vibes coming into you with another product review. And in this video, I will be doing a review on the Veda Shea Alma. Um, as many of you know who follow my channel, I've been in a search for another staple natural hair butter cream, something that's going to moisturize my hair. I did pick this up from my, um, we have a boutique here in the local Houston area called Tendles and Curls. I will leave the information below and they carry a whole different variety of a lot of different natural hair products. Um, so I went in and they had this actually out and I tested it and I really liked the way it felt in my hand. I wasn't able to feel it on my hair. So I have been using it for a couple days out the way they had it packaged. They even had the top sealed. And to me, when I looked at it, it kind of looked very scientific. They have all the labels specifically formated, uh, formulated for kinky, curly, and wavy hair textures. How curly are you? They got the patterns on there. I did pay $19.50 for this product. Um, it is enriched with natural oils, exotic butters, nourishing extracts, and botanicals. So I thought even the jar alone, I'm going to read a little bit about the ingredient. It says our ingredients offer only the highest quality effervatic herbal and organic ingredients that have been known for the healing process. They have their philosophy on there. And then here's some of the, the ingredients. I've noticed a lot of the uh, uh, hair butters that I've been trying that have actually worked. A lot of them are convey, um, are containing the aloe vera because it's been extremely hot here in Houston and I'm just having issues finding something. But if you haven't checked out my Donna Marie video, check it out. I'll leave the link below. Um, but this product is extremely whipped. It looks thicker than it really is, but it's really whipped. It, it's really whipped. It rem really reminds me of like a trips to Bahamas, the islands, Jamaica. Wise words for the day, just love, be no hater. Let's say vibes got some really thin. And for about two days, as you'll see, my hair, I haven't even picked it out. I've just been finger picking it. I did wash it on yesterday using here on yesterday using my Shea Moisture Thickening Shampoo. And then I followed up with the anti, the anti breakage mask. Uh, this is in the same family of the organic and yucca as a shampoo. So I use those two. Then I sealed my hair with the extra virgin olive oil and then I just put this throughout, allowed it to just air dry and this is the next day. So what I'll be doing this evening is I'm going to do a braid out using this alone to see how I like it. I mean so far it's okay for $19.50 and um, this is an 8 ounce product. So I'll come back to you on tomorrow with the final results and my final review. I'm just taking a look at my hair now, it doesn't look bad. Of course, I sealed it and just finger styled it, um, and I'll come back on tomorrow with the final. I'm going to do a braid out using this product alone. Um, I was thinking about sealing it, but I want to see how it works by itself as a standalone since I did seal my hair on yesterday. Okay, so please stay tuned for the final reviews. And now it's time for the takedown. I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to go ahead and take these down. Um, actually, when I was putting it through my hair, because I've been using it for a few days just on an afro, when I was putting it in, I could really feel it, um, you know, going into the, the hair, really penetrating into my hair. So I'm going to take this down and I'll come back with the final results and the final review. Check Okay, now here's for the final look. Do a little spin for you. Okay, now for my final reviews, um, I love the definition that it's done for my hair for the Afro Veda whipped cream. Um, I've been using it for a few days. It's just not as hydrating, and that's the problem that I've been having with looking for a lot of these. Um, butter creams and paying all this money like I stated this is $19.50 what I've learned in this whole experience because I've been dealing with this maybe for the last six weeks or so where I've been shopping around trying some different things a few of my friends that um, have natural hair as well have 
gave me a few products to try. I'm going to stick with what has been working for me uh, thus far because it can get pretty expensive spending money on all these natural hair products and not getting the results that you're looking for. And then when you have those products, you're basically just using them. Like when they don't work for me, I basically just use them when my hair is either in protective style or when I'm just pushing my hair up in a ponytail for some other styles. I'm spending more than $10 on a buttercream. I expect to be able to use it without having to mix this and mix that with it. So lesson learned for me, I'm gonna stick with, with what's currently working and leave all the extra stuff alone as always thanks so much for watching thanks for your support and i'll see you in the next video bye, yo. Bye, yo. she says love my good hair let's say vibes y'all keeping it live y'all she says love my good hair let's say vibes y'all vibes y'all she says love my good hair